Scientists fly over a giant chunk of Antarctic ice as it cracks and collapses. The chunk is enormous, about seven times the size of Manhattan, 160 square miles. It was part of the Wilkins Ice Shelf, the biggest on Antarctica yet, scientists say, to fall victim to global warming. Watching Wilkins Ice Shelf disappear at the moment, we learn a lot more about how ice responds to climate change. The ice is just a small fraction of the Antarctic ice sheet, but it broke off well before scientists predicted, a sign they say that climate change might be happening faster than expected. One expert told us last year... But I think what we, what we do know is that ice uh, um, is probably our best sensor of these large-scale changes taking place. And in many ways, I think we're in un unchartered territory. Ice plays a vital role in cooling the Earth's temperature and regulating sea levels. As it's lost, the planet gets warmer, sea levels rise, and more ice is threatened, a vicious environmental circle. By the end of the century, many experts project sea levels will rise between 7 and 23 inches, and temperatures could increase by up to 7 degrees Fahrenheit. But some say those estimates are too conservative. There are glaciologists now who are getting very worried, but they haven't really come out and said what they think. This part of the Antarctic is warming about five times faster than the rest of the world. Six other ice shelves have been lost entirely, and scientists say the Wilkins Shelf could be next. Emily Chang, CNN, London.